Hey, Crazy Soda Man Gamer here, and I'm going to play Deliver Us from the Moon. Apparently, there um, there's a small little cutscene at the beginning of this that kind of like says, "Hey, there's a energy crisis, and it's been solved by finding helium three on the moon." And then just one day, the power stopped, and they had to kind of shut shut down the space agency, and now a few people left left that uh, kind of wanted to do it is going to go to the moon i'm a little confused about what's going on but we will start a new game and here we go friends and family of the missing lunar colonists gather all around the world tonight in remembrance of the 2054 mp2 blackout that resulted in a global power outage and the loss of contact with the lunar colony hmm. the blackout caused global turmoil which ultimately led to the closure of the world space agency one year later in other news, the recent formation of the largest dust storm on record has prompted climatologists to readjust their forecast of the equatorial desert's growth rate. Huh. As a result of the new storm, the desert could soon cover 30% of the globe's landmass. It honestly sounds like interstellar. support for refugees despite reports of resource shortages. The dust storm is expected to hit residential zones between the northern 49th and 50th latitude lines by late afternoon. And it's very like agency's former MP2 ground station in the Adirao Desert. Authorities have imposed a mandatory evacuation of the impacted area. For countries north of the equatorial desert, temperatures are expected to be a mild 46 degrees Celsius. This was Nicole Sage for World News One, September 16, 2059. Wishing you a safe and happy day. Patina, are you there? Louie. Yes. Hmm. Let me just grab that. Okay. Ground control to Fortuna One. This is Claire. Please confirm radio contact. It doesn't feel buggy. Radio contact, contact confirmed. Make your way to the launch platform and prime the rocket for liftoff. We have to launch before the dust storm hits. It gives me a sense of like my computer's like kind of broken, but I know it's not that. It's for launch but you need to hurry the dust storm will hit this area in a few hours if we don't succeed now the fortuna mission will be over for good can they say that it can also be first person ah uh, oh well uh, all right let's go Very pretty game. Looks like we have the Russians helping sprint with. Look, okay. All right. Let's. Ooh, what is this? We can go in here. In here, I can still. Imagine a world free of fossil fuels. Well, I kind of wonder what happened. Kathy, Claire. Oh, wait, I am in first person. I gotta flush them toilets. Okay. Alright, let's scan things a little bit. Okay, so now I got like things to recover. Okay, cool. Alright. I'm not looking for a complete playthrough. I'm actually really more interested in this story of what's going on here. Ooh, it's up here. I did something before I was supposed to do it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's go up. Good. I see you're on your way up to 
the facility. The control center is located on the top floor. There you can plan the rocket for launch. Alright. Oh, it's not the way out? Let's see. Oh, I press the button. It's been five years since we last received a microwave power transmission from the lunar colony. At hmm. first, no one believed it would be possible to transmit energy from the moon back to Earth. But the WSA proved the skeptics wrong. Just well, like you will, when you get the MPT back online. So I'm getting things back online. Cool. All right, um, where am I? Five, six, three, two. Ah, uh, okay. Well, time for me to find out passcodes and stuff. Passcodes. Three, five, four, eight. Three, five, four, eight. Three, five, four, eight. Three, five, four, eight. Wow, that wasn't too hard. Wait, I can collect it? Oh. oh I can kind of see it. What's in here? Nothing. Okay, let's go this way. This building once functioned as part of the WSA, but it's been our home for many years now. I still can't believe you'll be leaving here for good soon. The desertification of this whole region won't take long after the storm passes through. Huh. Oh, this des desertification process doesn't sound too good. Curiosity questions and oh, I jump. Cool. Radio waves go bzz, 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 to Earth. Isaiah Johnson designed it. Moon hub, Pearson, tether status unknown. Have a reactor there. Ooh, what is this? Broken. Okay. Okay, let's not go upstairs. Let's jump down here now. Maybe free down the elevator. I oh wait, hold on. Oh crap. Oh, okay, it's just teaching me how to move things. Oh wait, I have a have a percent of battery. Uh, that's gonna be annoying later.
button as you go. Thank you, everyone. Okay, ooh, what is this? Beer pong. This seems important. Launch ground signature, overflow arm access, auxiliary power units, gases, oxygen arm vent, engine head off, stage separation. I'm going to get that run up to all of us. All right, well, only one way to do this. Go up the stairs and go up the stairs and good. You're in the control center. Get the rocket ready to launch as fast as possible. Uh, why me? All right, rebooting, rebooting. Calculating new storm ETA. Claire, we have a problem. The storm is approaching faster than expected. Way faster. Time's running out. Keep going, Fortuna. We've been working too long to give up now. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what's my objective? Close both. Sure. Okay, I guess I'm going outside to go do that. Where to go? Find a control room, find the rocket. Come on, Master Chief, you can do this. Uh, wait, I'm dumb. It's right here. 
right here all along. That's closed. Prime rocket, prime rocket, prime rocket. Uh, prime rocket, prime rocket, prime. Sit. It's emergency. so long. Rocket navigation systems online. We're nearly there. It's just like your training. You can do this. Initiate this. launch procedure. Just never trade for this. Um. Yeah, I was never, never quite trained for this. Um. Yeah. Okay, but before I launch i am just going to in this here and um yeah <laughs> just like that just end all right but uh y'all take care and um i'll catch y'all next time